over to grab him so he won't fall off the sofa and now he got a fever so i'm just like man so basically case was sick that hubby was sick and connor was sick and i know connor was confirmed to have the flu so i'm assuming that's what the <coughs> other ones had too so i treated it as such and um this was connor was diagnosed tuesday and then my husband came home from work Tuesday, sick, so he didn't go to work, and he don't miss work, he, um, because he don't work, he don't get paid, he didn't go, uh, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, wait, was it Wednesday, I think it was Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and then sometimes he'll work on Saturday, you know, to, to do extra work, he didn't go Saturday either, so he missed, if I'm not mistaken, he missed four days, or three days, and then the Saturday that he sometimes, he'll work. I was like, I know he had to feel bad, but it was rough on me. Like, they were wearing me out. He just got out of bed yesterday. Because I'm like, you have to get up and, you know, kind of make yourself feel like more like normal. Because you can't just get up and go to work Monday and think everything will be fine. But you're still going to feel weak. So you have to get up and get in the groove and just kind of push yourself. So, women, y'all know how men get when they get sick because we can have a baby and go run a marathon tomorrow after you know so it don't phase us because i had to do last year and it was like it was a school day a thursday i came home early and i was confirmed to have the flu and the next day by the time the boys got home i was up. i wasn't feeling good at all but i know i had to get up and do what i had to do so the next day i was up and doing whatever I had to do. I was a little sluggish, well, a lot sluggish, but I still did it, and I got up until I just made myself feel better. So, but anyway, enough about that, but yesterday I was, I'm, I was like extreme cleaning a lot of stuff, and I'm still not done, but I washed everybody's sheets again, and um, I'm finally back in the bed, <laughs> and um, I got a phone call, and it was the people from Massage Envy that were calling to remind me of my scheduled appointment today. And I always forget, because I'm like, I don't put it in my head, because I'm like, they're going to call me anyway, because, you know, they'll call you and let you know, so I don't just remember the date. And so I had forgot all about it, but that was right on time, because your girl need a Woosa, a cow going to take me away moment. So I'm about to go and do that, and after that, I need to go run some errands um cam's birthday is tomorrow he's turning four he's excited he's been walking around the house for the past couple of days saying um my birthday coming my birthday coming like you just go his birthday gonna walk up to him and say hey so uh, he he don't get it so we were gonna celebrate today with uh family and one of my nephews he has the flu too so since everybody has been sick i think i'm gonna just put it off until next weekend to um actually celebrate his birthday but tomorrow my mom is gonna i'm gonna buy some cupcakes and take it to daycare and she is gonna go and celebrate at the daycare with him tomorrow so he'll be excited about that but i felt bad because we couldn't do it today and um but he's four he really don't understand so we'll just celebrate next week i don't want to get anybody else sick and um yeah, so I'm just headed to my massage and I'm gonna go do what I need to do afterwards. But guess what? I'm gonna take my time 
because I have been tied up taking care of sick people running a, a mini clinic at the house and I'm over there. I said, God forbid I get sick because I'm using up all my time on y'all. And I had planned to go to the school for camp tomorrow, but since I was out Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday, <coughs> I don't want to take the time off tomorrow to go celebrate. So thank goodness my mom could step in and, and go. He would enjoy it. And I didn't tell him, so he's going to be surprised. But he will see the cupcake, so I don't know. He may just think they're going to do the cupcake, but I didn't tell him that she was coming. And I'm sure he's going to be um, pleasantly surprised by that. So, um, but anyway, with all that being said, thank y'all so much for tuning in. I hope y'all make it to the end of this video. If not, just thank you for clicking on it. Um, yeah, and I, um, I'll get back with y'all. I don't know if I'm going to wait until after I'm done with my massage to come back to see y'all. But I'll get back with y'all shortly. No, ma'am. Come on, pick me up. <laughs> <laughs>